Hello everyone. Today we will be talking about the properties of logarithm. This is the second part. I will put the link of the first part in the description box below. So this uh, power property has this equation right here. So we have log of a to the power m. So whatever the power is, you put it in front of the log, that becomes a coefficient. And so that becomes m equals log of a what? Ever the exponent is every time no matter what you put it in front that's the power property now let's take this example right here so we are supposed to solve for x on this 5 to the power x equals 20 now if we look at this one here 5 to the power 1 is 5 and 5 to the power 2 is 25 so that means this x should be between 1 and Two. So is that 1.5? Is it 1.7? We don't know what it is. So it's it, this one has to be a decimal that should be between 1 and 2. So we are going to go through the steps using the power proper to solve for the x here. So I'm going to write the steps right here on the side. So let's take step 1 first. We are going to log both sides. So that's the first step. Log both sides. So in this problem, I am going to log both sides. This would come out log of 5 to the power x equals log of 20. So I, I log both sides. Now the second step is to use the power property. So use the power property to simplify. So we're going to use the power property. So in this um, problem right here. We are go this equation would come out again. The power is going to go to the front So this becomes x log of 5 equals log of 20 Okay, so we already um, Use the power property step 3 is to solve for x solve for x to solve for x we are supposed to divide both sides we want x by itself so that means we are going to divide both sides by log of 5 because we want the x by itself on that side so divide this by log of 5 so then we can cross the log of 5 and log of 5 so then our x is um actually the x that we have here is this one right here so that is log of 20 over log of 5 so this is our um this is our x now if we want that because this one is like a um like it's, it looks like an expression a complicated one we can use calculator to find the value for x to do that we are supposed to divide it so that means we are going to do log of 20, close parentheses. Be sure that you close the parentheses. Divided by log of 5, close parentheses. And that's the answer right there in decimal forms. It's almost around 2. So then we can go ahead and write the x is also equal to 1.86135311.6. So this is the decimal version of this expression right there now let's check if we got the correct answer to this by plugging back the x into the equation so we're now checking so first we have 5 to the power let's take the first um answer first so that's log of 20 divided by log of Five, so that's actually the exponent for the whole thing. So let's use the calculator to see what is the value for this. So that would be 5 to the exponent log of 20 divided by log of 5. And our expected answer for this is 20. So that is equal to 20. Good. So then we are correct. And that is equal to 20. Now let's use the other number right here, the one that we got. So we can set it up 5 to the exponent 
5535116. Let's see if that is equal to 20. So we go ahead and type that in. 5 to the exponent 1.8613. Three one one six. So the answer is supposed to be 20, let it see, and the answer is 20 right there. So then our x value is correct. So these two are, uh, these two are correct answers. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe for more math videos. See ya!